we've added something new today to the puppy nursery. And on their own, after mom crawled in the crate, the puppies crawled in and some of them have fallen asleep in the crate while others are playing and you can see India's chewing on the crate. We'll add toys and things to the crate. Indy loves his toys. So they're awake in here, just observing. It was fun to watch Ellie Grace crawl in on her own as she wanted to explore the inside of a crate. We have a large playpen. In fact, we have a YouTube video about our playpen that we leave our dogs in when we're not home. But we like to make sure that we've trained our puppies to be comfortable in a crate in case you decide that uh, you want your puppy to be crate trained at your home. So this makes it really easy day one. Your puppy comes already comfortable being in a crate. So these puppies will be four weeks old in two days. So a little short of four weeks old, and they're already learning to be very comfortable inside a crate. This particular crate has a side door, and then it also has a door on the other end over here. So depending on which way you wanna structure it in your home setup, you can. But I recommend if you're going to use a crate, when your puppy arrives at home, you'll have the structured area for the crate. And when you're not able to pay attention to your puppy, the puppy goes inside the crate. And then you'll have a potty pad that's moving towards the door that you want the puppy to use. So as these puppies get more comfortable with this area, this potty pad will be moved over towards the door. And when you see your puppy moving towards the potty pad, that's when you know to take your puppy outside. Eventually you'll get to the point where the potty pad is right in front of your back door or whatever door you're going to take your dog in and out of to go potty. And um, you will use that as your cue that it's time to take the dog outside. Puppies need a very small space. So these puppies can actually spend the next several weeks, months even, in this uh, master bathroom here in my home. And we have a gate, we actually have two different gates. We'll put another gate on this shortly. But this gate opens like this. And this gate will not work when they are super little because they can slip through it. So we add a secondary gate, which is right here, to this gate once they start uh, trying to get out and go into the bedroom. Again, you'll want your puppy to be watched, monitored by you, and when your puppy's not able to be watched by you, then it's going to be in a crate like this or in a play area like this where there's a very confined structure so that your puppy learns to be potty trained in your home environment. By the time these puppies are eight weeks old, they are very well potty trained in my environment here, and they have a, uh, a, a system, a structure that they know. This is where we sleep, this is where we eat, this is where we play with our toys. But I want you to be thinking about how you will recreate that in your own home. So here they are, this is Oliver. Hi, Oliver. Good morning. Yes, yes. Hello, Truffles. Hello, Truffles. And Ellie Grace's family is coming today. So exciting. Yes, yes, Ellie Grace, you're going to get to spend some time with your family today. So fun. Yes. And these two back here were eating. They were on an eating binge just a few minutes ago. And so they have conked out. This is Godiva. Hello, Godiva. Hello, Godiva. And Nestle, there you are back there, little boy. Hi, cutie pie. Hi, Nestle, let's bring you out, Nestle. 
Nestle's moving around and playing and oh my goodness, so pretty. Gonna be all just so handsome. Green eyes, I don't know if you can see how beautiful his green eyes here in this lighting. Maybe I'll bring them out and see if you can see what it looks like when they decide to go back in. But they can crawl right over that now. They're walking very easily. Look at the little tail going. Truffle's little tail was just wagging right there. So cute. Hi, Truffles. Here's Grace. Grace actually went in first and laid down, which enticed them all to come in, as you can see. So here we go. They'll start now uh, coming in. Say, oh, I'm gonna go see mom. And one of the things about getting a dog from us is that you get an extremely well socialized dog. We regularly have people come visit and play with, and then our dogs also have the opportunity to get to know other dogs in our pack. So this is Sweet Tea, and Sweet Tea is in season right now. It's her first season, so we will not be breeding her. We'll breed her next time after she's a year old that she comes in season. And this, is Nestle. Nestle is a white chocolate schnauzer puppy and you can see that the puppies get the opportunity to socialize. Everything's always very supervised here. So puppies playing in the SVCC Toys Nursery on November 6, 2022. Hope you have a great day.